Now, this is a really good tip. Uh, there are times that you have a, a an application on screen and you don't want the screen to change. You could be reading an ebook, you can be handing the phone over to your child and you have their favorite game on and you just don't want them to press a button and get out of it. Or what I find very frustrating is when I give my phone to someone else to take a picture and then when they're grabbing it, they press the wrong button and the camera disappears. And then I have to get out of pose and go and help them get back to the camera because everybody has different phones. So I'm going to show you this tip uh, and in order to enable it, first thing you have to do is you got to go into settings. Uh, we're going to do a search, and then we're going to go pin windows. Uh, you can type it up here. I had already looked it up. Once you choose pin windows, in the pin window, you'll make sure that this thing is enabled. So you notice that mine is. And what will happen is the next time you go into a actual application, um, this recent list, you'll notice that some of these have a little pin. Uh, if I were to choose, and notice this is my camera, if I choose pin, when I open it up, I get the option to actually lock the actual camera in that mode and notice another thing is I can actually tell it um, only unlock it when uh, providing a fingerprint so uh, let me show you what happens now so I'm gonna hit start I'm not gonna use my fingerprint now the uh, the actual application the camera is locked um, no matter what I press you notice I'm pressing the back button I'm pressing the home button I'm pressing the multi key button nothing is changing nothing will change and you notice what it says right there as soon as I press it it says to unpin you have to press your recent and your back button at the same time so I'm gonna press and hold and now it says that it's uh, been unpinned. Let's do it again. There it is. Application is no longer pinned. Now when I hit back, I go back to my screen. 